Um, how do you do question number eight? Okay, let's take a look. We have a square root of x in between of the four and the nine. And the question is asking, this expression is equivalent to um, which of the following? All right, so let's take a look at the answers right now. Well, let's go over some examples. How can we deal with the square root and some numbers, all right? So let me show you guys first example. And just forget about this question for a minute. If I ask you, square root of x is equal to 4, what does that tell us about x? How can we solve for x in another word? Well, square root of what is equal to 4? To solve that, when you see square root, what we can do is just square, root, uh, square both sides. Square and square root cancel each other out, right? And 4 to the second power is equal to 16. So we know from square root of x equals to 4, we get x is equal to 16. Likewise, let me take a look at example number 2. When you, have square, when you have square root of x equals to 9, I'm not looking at the, example, <laughs> looking at the question for a minute, all right? When you have square root of x equals to 9, what can we say about x? Well, we can do the same, right? We can do the same procedure. We can square both sides. Square, square root, cancel out. 9 squared means 9 times 9, which is 81. So this is how you deal with um, equation with square roots. But in this question here, we have 4. So let me just write down the question. We have 4 less than square root of x less than 9. So another way to read this is, as I uh, said earlier, square root of x is in between of 4 and 9. What we can deal with square root is just square it. Raise everything to the second power. And let me do that. Square, square, square. Right, raise base, uh, everything to the second power. This tells us 4 squared, which is 4 times 4, that's 16. And I will keep the inequality sign. Square and square root cancel, so I have an x. And then 9 squared, 9 times 9, which is 81. So, if square root of x is in between of 4 and 9, then x has to be in between of 16 and 81. Let me take a look. Aha, that's answer choice E. Answer choice E. Got it.